What a mess. You all know what that means. It means shit's getting done. Okay, you are probably really frustrated if you're watching this video. Because I was about three hours ago until I figured this out. How to scan something. Alright, I have the Canon MP40. It's um, a printer slash scanner and it also works as a photocopier. But, let me get to the point. I'm a grade 12 student. I was asked to edit all the baby pictures into a slideshow. I didn't want to use a slideshow. I want to use Sony Vegas and turn it into a video. But either way, I have a physical photograph that needs to be converted into a digital uh, file. So here is how you do it. Take your picture or document or file or anything. Put it face down on your scanner. Now, my scanner has a little black line that you see whenever you scan something. So I like to avoid this edge here. So I always put it there. And make sure the picture is nice and even because it'll be crooked when you scan it. Now, here's the part that you're all asking about. Before I start that, I installed Canon software, which crashed every single time I opened it, which really pissed me off. And I went to their website and updated all the firmware and it still doesn't work. So I gave up and used my computer skills to figure this out and, and well, I prevailed. I figured it out. So here is how you do it. Okay, I have a variety of buttons here. Um, do not push any of them, <laughs> okay? First of all, I know you like my wallpaper. I took it myself, actually. Okay, so let's get to it. Type, go to your start bar and type in scanner and you've got Microsoft Office Document Scanner. Open that. Now, you're going to have black and white, black and white from color page, color, and grayscale. Now, I have color selected, just like that. Now, because I have a colored picture and I want a colored copy of it. So, click on color, and they have this little logo here. Click on scan. It'll say waiting for bulb to warm up or whatever. And you can hear it scanning, and you can see its progress. And it's done. And here's what it scanned. I have the picture right here. It's all done. Now I can save it. So I want to save it. Would you like to save changes? Yes. I want to save it to my desktop. I'm going to call it ASDF. And it's saved. Now I can open it in uh, Paint because, you know, I obviously have this white bar that I don't want. So I'll just cut out what I want. I want that. Move it up there. Right in there. Save picture. Would you like to save the changes? Yes, I would. Now I can open this. And that is how you convert a physical photograph into a digital photograph. Thank you for watching. Please feel free to subscribe. You know, I really don't give a shit. Bye. Oh, what an awful video.